you feel insecure? Do you find it difficult to believe in yourself and your abilities? Do you stop for fear of what others will say? Insecurities are more common feelings than you think. They are emotions that affect millions of people around the world. Insecurity can manifest itself in many ways. It can make us feel anxious, depressed or angry. It can stop us from pursuing our dreams or taking risks. Often, insecurity is based on negative and irrational thoughts about ourselves. We think we are not good enough, smart enough or attractive enough. We compare ourselves to others and feel inferior. Insecurity can be a major obstacle in our lives, affecting our self-esteem, our relationships and our potential. But I want you to know that insecurity does not have to control you. On the contrary, you are the owner of your life, the captain of your ship, and you have the power to control and eradicate them. Stoic philosophy, with its emphasis on virtue, reason and acceptance, offers valuable tools for overcoming insecurity and building a fuller, more secure life. In this video, we will present you eight lessons from Stoic philosophy, which will help you overcome insecurity and transform your life. Let's first find out what self-confidence really means. Beyond appearance, self-confidence is not just a pose or a facade to impress others. It is a deep inner conviction of our worth, our capabilities, and our ability to meet life's challenges. This confidence does not arise overnight. It is built from a process of honest and deep self-knowledge. It involves recognizing and accepting both our strengths and our weaknesses without judgment or self-criticism. In the words of Stoic philosophy, self-confidence lies in leveraging our strengths and working on our weaknesses. It's not about being perfect, but about being aware of who we are and using our characteristics to achieve our goals. True confidence does not depend on external approval or praise. It is an internal compass that guides us even in times of uncertainty or difficulty. Developing self-confidence is a continuous journey of personal growth. It involves learning from our mistakes, celebrating our achievements, and maintaining a positive attitude towards life. The Stoic sage, Epictetus, said that we should not stress about the things we cannot control, but rather work on what we can change, such as our attitudes, thoughts, and actions. We tend to associate self-confidence with an image of unwavering confidence and poise. However, true self-confidence is a deeper concept that goes beyond appearances. Self-reflection and self-judgment are also important to become more confident. By looking inside ourselves, we can see what we need to work on and be proud of what we have done well. This continuous process of learning and growth helps us know what we can do and how to overcome our doubts by being resilient. Stoicism teaches us to see problems as opportunities to learn and improve. Accepting and learning from our failures instead of fearing them makes us stronger and more prepared for what comes next. Finally, self-confidence grows by doing things. Stoicism tells us that simply thinking about ideas is not enough. You need to use them. So try to apply these ideas every day by facing what scares you, making brave decisions and living according to your beliefs. You will develop something real and lasting. Understanding yourself is the first step to explore what it really means to be mindful as you build confidence. Stoic self-examination is not just about analyzing yourself. It is about discovering who you really are at your core and what you are capable of doing. Epictetus, the famous Stoic thinker, tells us to look closely, to discover our true motivations and fears. True self-confidence comes from this honest and deep understanding of yourself. Let's think about how important it is to know our interior well. That's why we wanted to bring you these eight stoic lessons that will transform your life. Are you ready to start our journey? Accompany me. Number one, knowing you from within. Knowing yourself is a fascinating and profound journey towards self-awareness. It is understanding the complex dance between your thoughts, beliefs, interpretations, and the internal dialogue that shapes your perception of the world and yourself. By having positive internal dialogues and questioning your doubts about yourself, you can begin to change. Being aware also means recognizing and valuing your emotions. Your emotions say a lot about what really matters to you and what scares you. Knowing your feelings and understanding why you have them makes you learn a lot about what motivates you and what you really want. Ultimately, understanding your inner universe leads you to be genuine, 
Stick to your values and always be yourself. This isn't always easy, especially when others expect you to act a certain way. However, by being true to yourself, you become more confident and create stronger, more honest connections with others. The journey towards self-understanding is a transformative process that not only enriches our perception of ourselves, but also opens the doors to better interaction with the world around us. As we deepen the knowledge of our essence, we cultivate a strong confidence that drives us to reach our full potential. Every step you take in this process helps you become a better version of yourself. It's really about understanding that some things are simply out of our hands. This makes us pay more attention to what we are good at and what we can do. Having this mindset makes us feel more in control and independent, showing us that although we can't control everything in life, we can always choose how we respond. This could mean letting go of anger from the past or worries about what is to come. Understand that we cannot remake the past or predict the future, but we can improve our lives now with what we do today. As you learn about yourself, you will understand that it is okay to not know everything and feel vulnerable. Sometimes being okay with uncertainty and knowing your limits is important for personal growth. This type of acceptance frees you to try new things and leads to experiences that can change the way you see yourself and others. Number two, self-acceptance. Feeling insecure is a common experience which can affect anyone at some point in their lives. Often this insecurity has its origin in the lack of self-acceptance in the difficulty of valuing and appreciating ourselves as we are. Stoic philosophy teaches us that self-confidence does not arise overnight. It is a process of self-discovery that involves knowing and accepting ourselves in our entirety, both with our virtues and our imperfections. The first step to overcoming insecurity is learning to accept ourselves with all our strengths and weaknesses. This does not mean settling for less, but recognizing that we are valuable people by our very nature. Recognizing our weaknesses is a fundamental pillar of self-confidence. It's about embracing our complex nature and using it as a tool for our personal growth. Self-acceptance allows us to build a solid foundation of self-esteem from which we can face life's challenges with greater confidence and security. By accepting our imperfections, we let go of the need to constantly compare ourselves to others and free ourselves from the tyranny of perfection. This opens the door to the possibility of expressing our authenticity and connecting with others in a more genuine way. There will be times when we doubt ourselves, but if we remain firm in our commitment to accept ourselves, little by little we will build a healthier and more loving relationship with ourselves. Start by practicing self-compassion. Instead of punishing yourself with harsh criticism, adopt a compassionate attitude. Remember that we all make mistakes and that kindness to yourself in those moments is essential. Imagine how you would treat a friend in a similar situation with understanding and support. Forget about constant self-criticism. Instead, recognize your mistakes as opportunities for learning and growth. This change in perspective can significantly reduce feelings of insecurity and make way for greater self-confidence. Remember, self-pity does not mean self-indulgence. It's about being kind and understanding with yourself, especially during difficult times. Recognize your triumphs, no matter how small they seem. Every advancement is proof of your progress and strength. Surround yourself with people with positive influences who encourage and support you. This boost can strengthen your self-esteem and help you maintain a balanced view of your abilities and achievements. Learning to love yourself does not mean seeking unattainable perfection. On the contrary, it is about recognizing and accepting that we are beings in constant evolution. Accepting yourself means recognizing that it's okay to have flaws. It is essential to understand that your value does not depend on being perfect or meeting external standards, but on your intrinsic value as a human being. You can practice self-acceptance by participating in activities that bring you joy and satisfaction. Find hobbies and interests that resonate with you and spend time doing things that make you feel good about yourself. These activities can boost your sense of self-esteem and help you appreciate your unique qualities. Incorporate a personal care routine into your daily life. This practice, which can include exercise, reading, 
meditation, or simply a relaxing bath, is a way to express self-love and strengthen your physical and mental well-being. Prioritize activities that nourish your body and mind. This practice can improve your overall sense of well-being and confidence. It is also helpful to reflect on your achievements and strengths. You can keep a journal where you document moments when you felt proud of yourself or overcame challenges. Reviewing these achievements can remind you of your capabilities and reinforce your self-acceptance. Lastly, avoid seeking validation from others. External approval can be rewarding, but it should not be the basis of your life or your self-esteem. Learn to validate yourself and trust your own judgment. This internal validation can provide a stable sense of confidence that is not easily shaken by external opinions. Number three, set realistic goals. Setting realistic goals is essential to building confidence. Unrealistic goals can lead to frustration and self-doubt, while achievable goals provide a sense of accomplishment and motivation. Stoicism offers valuable principles for setting realistic goals and achieving personal success. Stoic wisdom reminds us that you must first define what is under your control, everything over which you have direct influence, such as your thoughts, actions, reactions, and effort. Remember that aspects that are out of your control, such as the opinions of others, weather conditions, or random events, you will not be able to handle. Focusing on what you can control will allow you to set realistic goals and avoid frustration when chasing unattainable goals. To define meaningful goals, reflect on your deepest values and principles. What are you passionate about? What motivates you to get up every morning? What kind of legacy do you want to leave in the world? By answering these questions, you will identify the aspects that really matter to you and that give you a sense of purpose. Align your goals with these values so that the process of achieving them is more meaningful and rewarding. Start by identifying your long-term goals and break them down into smaller, more manageable steps. When you set specific, measurable, achievable, relevant and time-bound goals, you will increase your chances of success. This framework ensures that your goals are clear and achievable. For example, instead of setting a vague goal like getting in shape, specify your goal more clearly, like running three times a week for 30 minutes. To track your progress, it's also crucial to keep a journal or use an app to record your achievements. This visual representation of your progress can boost your confidence and keep you motivated. Reflect on your successes regularly and recognize the effort you put into achieving them. Also, be flexible with your goals. Life is unpredictable and circumstances can change. Adapt your goals as necessary, but don't lose sight of where you want to go. Flexibility allows you to face challenges without becoming discouraged. Celebrate your achieved goals. Rewarding yourself for achieving your goals reinforces positive behavior and motivates you to continue working hard. Remember that every small victory strengthens your confidence and brings you closer to your biggest aspirations. Setting realistic goals requires self-awareness and a clear understanding of your current objectives and capabilities. Take the time to honestly evaluate your strengths and areas for improvement. This self-assessment can help you set goals that are challenging but achievable, ensuring you stay motivated without becoming overwhelmed. An effective goal-setting strategy is to create a vision board, which is nothing more than a visual representation of your goals and aspirations. By viewing your vision board regularly, you can keep your goals at the forefront of your mind and stay focused on what you want to achieve. This visualization technique can increase your motivation and commitment to your goals. Accountability is another crucial aspect of goal setting. Share your goals with a trusted friend, mentor or coach who can provide support and hold you accountable regularly. This mentoring can help you stay on track and make necessary adjustments. This external support can reinforce your commitment and provide valuable insights. Celebrate your accomplishments along the way, no matter how small they seem. Recognizing and rewarding your progress can boost your confidence and keep you motivated. Celebrations don't have to be big. Simple acts of recognition, such as enjoying a favorite activity or sharing your success with a friend, can make a significant difference. Finally, be patient and persistent. Achieving your goals can take time and there will be obstacles along the way. Understand that setbacks are a natural part of the journey 
use them as opportunities to learn and grow. With perseverance and a positive attitude, you can overcome challenges and continue making progress toward your goals. Number four, develop a growth mindset. The growth mindset is the belief that skills and intelligence can be developed through dedication and effort. Growth mindset is a term coined by Carol Dweck, one of the most prominent figures in the field of modern psychology. His revolutionary theory has provided an invaluable conceptual framework for understanding the profound impact that beliefs about individual intelligence and abilities have on learning, performance, and personal motivation. Working on this mentality contrasts with the fixed mentality that sees talents as innate and immutable. Adopting a growth mindset is vital to overcoming insecurity and building confidence. To develop a growth mindset, start by reframing your challenges. Instead of seeing them as threats, see them as opportunities to learn and grow. Accept failures as part of the learning process. Every setback is an opportunity to gain valuable knowledge and improve your skills. Focus on effort rather than results. Praise yourself for the hard work you put into tasks, regardless of the outcome. This shift in focus will help you appreciate the journey and reduce the fear of failure. This approach can be significant in boosting your confidence. Seek feedback and use it constructively. Feedback is a powerful tool for growth that provides specific areas for improvement. Instead of viewing feedback as criticism, view it as a guide for your development. This perspective can help you make continued progress and improve your self-confidence. Surround yourself with people who have a growth mindset. Positive attitudes and resilience can inspire and support you on your journey. Engage in discussions that promote learning and growth. Seek out mentors who can provide you with valuable ideas and encouragement. Cultivating a growth mindset means accepting the learning process and valuing effort. Understanding that skills and intelligence can be developed through dedication and hard work can help you approach challenges with optimism and resilience, seeing them as opportunities for growth rather than threats to your self-esteem. One way to foster a growth mindset is to seek out new learning opportunities. Enrolling in courses, attending workshops, or reading books that challenge your thinking and expand your knowledge by continually learning and growing, improve your skills and develop your confidence. Another important aspect is to see feedback as a tool to improve. Instead of taking them personally, look at them as valuable information that can help you grow. Use criticism as feedback to make necessary adjustments and continue making progress toward your goals. Foster a growth mindset by setting learning-oriented rather than performance-oriented goals that focus on the process of learning and improvement rather than being based on the end result. This approach can reduce the pressure to perform perfectly and allow you to enjoy the journey of personal growth. Lastly, practice resilience in the face of setbacks. Understand that failure is not a reflection of your value, but a natural part of the learning process. When you encounter obstacles, use them as opportunities to learn and grow. By maintaining a growth mindset, you can turn challenges into stepping stones to greater confidence and success. Number five, positive internal dialogue. The way you talk to yourself has a profound impact on your confidence. Negative self-talk can undermine your self-esteem and perpetuate insecurity, while positive self-talk can bolster your confidence, learning and resilience. Controlling and changing your internal dialogue is a powerful step in overcoming insecurity. Start by identifying negative patterns of self-talk, pay attention to your thoughts and notice when you criticize or doubt yourself. Insecurity is often fueled by negative and distorted thoughts about ourselves. It is important to learn to identify and question these thoughts. Ask yourself if they are realistic, logical and useful. Replace negative thoughts like, I'm not good enough, I'll never succeed, I'm always wrong with more rational and positive thoughts. Recognizing these patterns is the first step to changing them. Once you have identified the challenge of negative self-talk, ask yourself if these thoughts are based on facts or assumptions. Often, negative self-talk is rooted in irrational fears and misconceptions. Replace these thoughts with more realistic and positive affirmations. Practice daily affirmations, positive statements that reinforce your strengths and potential. For example, 
you can say to yourself, I am capable and strong. I can handle challenges with grace. Repeating affirmations can help rewire your brain so that you focus on your abilities instead of your limitations. Surround yourself with positivity, read motivational books, listen to uplifting music, or follow inspiring people and their positive influences. This can reinforce your self-talk and provide a supportive environment to build trust and change your self-talk. Start by practicing mindfulness. Mindfulness helps you become aware of your thoughts and feelings without judging them. By observing your thoughts, you can detect negative patterns of self-talk and consciously choose to replace them with positive affirmations. Developing the habit of daily affirmations can reinforce positive self-talk. Write down affirmations that resonate with you and repeat them every day as if it were a mantra. For example, affirmations like, I am capable, I deserve success, and I believe in myself can help you shift your mindset toward positivity and self-confidence. Engage in activities that promote a positive mindset. Surround yourself with uplifting content such as motivational books, podcasts, and videos. Engaging with positive media can influence your thoughts and reinforce a more optimistic outlook. Another effective technique is to practice gratitude every day. Write down some things you are grateful for. Focusing on gratitude can shift your perspective from what you lack to what you have. Fosters a feeling of abundance and positivity. This practice can improve your overall well-being and confidence. It's also important to be patient and gentle with yourself as you work to change your internal dialogue. Transforming deeply ingrained thought patterns takes time and effort. Celebrate your small victories and be kind to yourself when you encounter setbacks. Remember that positive self-talk is a journey, not a destination. And with every step forward, you are growing and progressing. Number six, develop resilience. Resilience is the ability to recover from adversity and continue moving forward. Developing resilience is essential to overcoming insecurity as it prepares you to handle setbacks and challenges with confidence. Stoic resilience, more than a simple virtue, is an unwavering commitment to personal growth. It's about embracing every experience, whether pleasurable or challenging, as a valuable learning opportunity about ourselves and the world around us. This philosophy of life allows us to face the ups and downs of existence with the deep conviction that we have the ability to overcome any obstacle that stands in our way. In the view of Stoicism, difficulties are temporary and surmountable, and a positive attitude must be maintained even in difficult times. To build resilience, start by surrounding yourself with friends, family and colleagues who help you by offering emotional support and encouragement. Knowing that you have people to turn to in times of need can boost your confidence and reduce feelings of insecurity. Stress can exacerbate insecurity by making it more difficult to face challenges. Practicing stress management techniques such as deep breathing, meditation and exercise can help you manage stress effectively. Regularly participating in these activities can improve your overall well-being and resilience. When you face a challenge, break it down into smaller, more manageable pieces and develop an action plan. Taking proactive steps to address problems can improve your sense of control and confidence. Learn from past experiences, reflect on previous challenges you have overcome and identify strategies that helped you succeed. Errors are a natural part of the learning process. Don't see them as failures, but as opportunities to improve. Analyze your mistakes objectively, identify what you can do better and use that information to adjust your strategy and keep moving forward. Use this knowledge to face new difficulties with confidence. Remember that every challenge you overcome increases your resilience, strength, and self-confidence. The Stoics remind us that adversity is inevitable on the path to success. It is important to anticipate that there will be obstacles and challenges and develop strategies to address them. This may include creating an action plan to overcome potential obstacles, seeking support from others, developing problem-solving skills, and maintaining a positive and resilient attitude. Maintain a positive outlook. Resilient people tend to view setbacks as opportunities for growth rather than insurmountable obstacles. Cultivate an optimistic mindset 
by focusing on what you can control and finding positives in difficult situations. Number seven, get out of your comfort zone. Getting out of your comfort zone is one of the most effective ways to build confidence. When you push your limits and try new things, you prove to yourself that you are capable of doing more than you initially thought possible. This process can be intimidating, but it is essential to overcoming insecurity and fostering personal growth. Start with small steps. Identify areas where you feel a little uncomfortable and take gradual steps to challenge yourself. For example, if social situations make you anxious, start by attending small gatherings and gradually work your way up to larger events. Set specific achievable challenges. For example, if public speaking intimidates you, set a goal of speaking in front of a small group and gradually increase the size of the audience. Each successful experience strengthens your confidence and prepares you for bigger challenges. Accept discomfort. Understand that feeling uncomfortable is a natural part of growing up. Instead of avoiding these feelings, acknowledge them and move on. Over time, what once seemed daunting will become manageable and your comfort zone will expand. Reflect on your experiences after leaving your comfort zone. Take time to reflect on what you learned and how much you grew. Recognize the progress you made, regardless of the outcome. This reflection can help you see the value in taking risks and encourage you to continue challenging yourself. When you face new challenges, visualize success. Before trying something outside your comfort zone, take a moment to visualize a successful outcome. Visualization is a powerful tool that can help you stay motivated and focused. Spend time each day vividly imagining what it will be like to achieve your goal. Visualize the steps you will take, the people who will support you, and the emotions you will feel when you reach your goal. This mental rehearsal can reduce anxiety and increase your confidence in your ability to succeed. Lastly, celebrate your courage. Taking steps outside your comfort zone takes courage, and it is important to recognize and celebrate your efforts. Reward yourself for taking risks and facing your fears, no matter how small the steps. This positive reinforcement can motivate you to continue pushing your limits. Number eight, watch your health. Physical and mental health are closely interconnected. Taking care of your body significantly impacts your confidence and overall well-being. When we feel good physically, it often translates into feeling good mentally and emotionally. Start by establishing an exercise routine. Regular exercise releases endorphins, which naturally boost your mood. Regular physical activity can reduce stress, improve your mood and self-esteem. Choose activities you enjoy to make exercise a sustainable part of your lifestyle. Nutrition also plays a crucial role in your confidence. A balanced diet provides the nutrients necessary for optimal brain function and energy levels. Avoid excessive consumption of processed foods, sugar and caffeine, which can negatively affect your mood and energy. Instead, Focus on whole foods, such as fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, and whole grains. Lack of sleep can lead to irritability, decreased cognitive function, and increased stress levels, all of which can undermine your confidence. Aim for eight hours of sleep each night to support your physical and mental health. Hydration is another essential aspect of physical health. Dehydration can affect your energy levels and cognitive function. Drinking at least eight glasses of water throughout the day will keep you hydrated and support your overall health and well-being. Finally, engaging in regular self-care practices, activities like yoga, meditation, and spending time in nature can reduce stress and improve mental clarity. Taking time for yourself helps you recharge and improves your ability to face challenges with confidence. Believing in yourself goes beyond a simple fleeting emotion. It is a skill that is cultivated with time and effort, a way of thinking deeply about life and our capabilities. By discovering our potential, we realize that our achievements are closely linked to the confidence we place in ourselves. This faith in our abilities not only drives us to act, but also allows us to persevere in the face of obstacles and take advantage of the opportunities presented to us. In other words, believing in yourself is the foundation on which success and personal fulfillment are built. It is the key that opens the doors to a world of possibilities 
and allows us to transform our lives. Lack of self-belief can be like a sneaky poison that corrodes our aspirations and dreams. Often without realizing it, we allow fear and doubt to stifle our potential, preventing us from achieving what we long for. Imagine the immense amount of talent and ability that lies dormant in the world, stifled by insecurity. People with extraordinary abilities, innovative ideas and grandiose dreams who never see the light of day because their inner flame goes out at the first murmur of doubt. It is as if an invisible shadow stands between us and our goals, whispering in our ears that we are not good enough, that we will not achieve it, that it is better not to try. And so, little by little, we are giving up our dreams, settling for a mediocre life far below our true potential. It does not have to be like that. We can choose to challenge that shadow, light the flame of self-confidence and take the reins of our destiny. It is not an easy path, but the prize in the end is worth it, a vibrant life full of meaning and personal fulfillment. Insecurity can be a major obstacle in our lives, but it does not have to be an insurmountable obstacle. Lessons from Stoic philosophy can help you overcome insecurity, develop self-confidence and transform your life. Building confidence and overcoming insecurity is a journey that requires patience, effort and dedication. I hope these eight Stoic lessons provide you with a comprehensive framework to help you overcome challenges, celebrate your successes and continually grow. True self-confidence does not depend on external approval or praise. It is an inner strength that is born from the recognition of our own value, regardless of the opinions of others. Confidence is not a destiny, but a process of learning and personal improvement that lasts a lifetime. This way of thinking helps us better cope with difficult moments in life and makes us stronger. Another important part of self-reliance is being genuine. It's important to be honest about who you are and what you really want. When you live by your own rules and not what others expect of you, you create a strong sense of inner peace and stability, which is key to true confidence. Remember, believing in yourself is a journey, not a destination. There will be times when you doubt, but if you stay firm on your path and follow the advice of the Stoics, you will be able to overcome any obstacle and achieve your goals. So far, our journey through Stoicism and its transformative power. I hope this journey has been eye-opening and has given you valuable tools to overcome insecurity and reach your full potential. If this video has inspired you, give us a like and subscribe to the channel. Share your opinions and experiences in the comments. Remember that your participation enriches our community and motivates us to continue learning and growing together, hand in hand, with timeless stoic wisdom.